to do to daf today? בעזרת השם, בוקר טוב. מסכת נזיד, דף כ"ב עמוד א', 22A1, says the Gimara Tashima, we're trying to bring a proof, if you remember, right, to what we were speaking about before. When it says, האישה שנדרה בנזיד, you remember we were speaking about the machloket, when a husband comes and he's going to do a farat nedarim, does it completely uproot it למפריה, which means retroactively does it uproot it, or it only make us guy that they cut it off from now until onwards. So Tashima, we're going to try to bring the proof. האישה שנדרה בנזיד, a woman comes and she says that she's going to become a nazi. Then he tzmet, and then she becomes tmeah. And then afterwards the husband comes and he does a farad nedarim. She has to bring the chata ta'ov. Then a meviyah ola ta'ov, but she doesn't bring the ola ta'ov. Remember that usually she has to bring two birds. One is a chatat, and one is an ola. But he said, if you're going to tell me, Baal Megaz Gai, that the husband cuts it off, she should also bring out ola ta'ov. So says the Gemara, Eve lamai, but rather, mekarakar. Obviously, the husband uproots it completely. So, so if you're going to tell me that it uproots it completely, why does she bring the chatata off? If it doesn't cut it off retroactively and it's only from now onwards, she should bring both. the chatata And if it does cut it off retroactively, she shouldn't bring anything. Says the Gemana, Achinam, you're right. Right, that what? The really bad match, she shouldn't bring the chatata off because it cuts it off retroactively. The Amani, who is this? The Bielazara Kapari. What does it mean when it says that she needs an atonement because she sinned on the nafesh? How did she sin? It was by accident. Rather, since the Nazir, he segregated himself from wine, he's called a sin. So it's a kavachomer. If this person only segregated himself from wine, and he's considered what? A choteh, I'm saying that's more. He called the var, somebody that stops himself from eating anything. You remember we learned this in Tanit. Alacha kama b'chama, all the more so is he considered a choteh. So says the Gemara, one second. Let's try to go the other way around. Tashema, the Tanit Mehedya, right? We learned it in Mifurash and Abraita. Ha'isha shenadar benazid, shama chavrita b'amlani. A woman comes, she says, I'm a nazira. The friend listens, and she says, Va'ani. The husband of the first one comes, and he annuls it. He does a farad nidarim. She's muteret, but the chavera is a surah. So Shema Mina, we learn from here, that the husband only cuts it off. But if you're going to tell me that the husband completely lemafreya, retractably uprooted the entire thing, so now there's nothing left. But if you're going to tell me that it only cuts it off, so from now onwards it cuts it off. But from before, when she said she's an izidah, and the friend took on a partner to her, so therefore it's going to be good. So Rabbi Shimon, Rabbi Shimon says, If she said to her though, I'm like you, but she didn't say, I'm also Nezira, I'm like you. So now if the husband comes and he uproots it, so I'm like you, right? I'm also uprooted. 22B. It does apply to the other, to the friend, to the first one? Let's go. Let's go. So Morzutra, Right, the son of Ramadi says, Hi, this is the dean of the Reisha in the beginning of the Braita is Rabbi Merchama. The buyer of Merchama, Rabbi Merchama comes and he asks the question, Imagine a person comes and he says, It's on to me like the meat of a Zevach Shlamim. Mahu, does there, is there Chal Anisul from the fact that he went and he said, This is on to me like the meat of a Zevach Shlamim? Right? Ki meat pis inish bi karamat, does he, does he, Take the, the beginning of his words, and therefore, if it's going to be like a basara shlamim, he's not allowed to do anything because until they don't sprinkle the blood and everything, he's not allowed to eat from it. Or dilmar maybe mitzina when mit What does that mean? Mitznana. What is mitznana? When it becomes cold, right? What does that mean? When it gets out of the yisur, which means that you already sprinkled the blood and now you're allowed to come and eat from it. So maybe that was his kavana. You came and you said, "Listen, this is like basara shlamim." Now you're not allowed to eat. Right, you're not allowed to eat the shlamim. You're not allowed to eat anything. Now, once they sprinkle the blood, yeah, now you're allowed to eat from it. But what do you take on the beginning of the words that it's like, a, or after it's already permitted? What's your what's your take on it? That's the question. So says the Gemara. Midami, can you compare both cases? Hatam there, Kevin the Amar. I didn't like it. Once you said it's on to me like Masaz of Shlamim. Afagav de lachar shenizak emo matziachi lebechutz. Right, even though after sprinkling its blood, you could eat it outside of the Beit Hamikdash, Mikdash Kadish, but it's still Kadosh Bemitzat. 
meaning you still have to eat it inside of Yerushalayim, betahara, in the proper time, shlamim has, you know, shlamim, you know, meaning you, you still have some parameters. He says, hacha here, you're going to tell me but it's in coming peace that it's in everything. The husband have completely approved it. There's nothing left. Meaning, don't compare the case of the shlamim to this. You're right. It's either before the shlamim, which means that I'm not allowed to eat it at all, but it's like a korban, or it's after the, the blood was sprinkled and everything that I'm allowed to eat it. But even though you're allowed to eat it, there's still certain guidelines. I have to eat it with a certain certain amount of tea, up time. I have to eat it within Yerushalayim. I have to. Meaning, it's not just stam, do whatever you want. But here, though, the husband announces it completely. It's either all or none. There, it's not all or none. There, it's all atsur or permitted, but with certain guidelines. Here, it's everything or nothing. So says the Gemara, Ikadamri. There are those that say that there was Hainu Dirami Merchama Vadai. That since for sure, it's like the Safeq of Rabbi Merchama. That just like in the Brayta, when a woman comes, she says she's going to grab on their matzav. It's going to be a sur. So too by the, by the shlamim, it's going to be a sur because of what he just said. That means this is a hundred percent of an isur. So Amrala, she sells to her friend hareni nezira beikevayich, right? Beikevayich. What's halacha, wow. right? And then afterwards, she was the, she did the hafaran nedarim. Okay, so here she's saying it is because of you basically. So is like for everything. The Sharia then she becomes permitted because again she did that for Nadarim. Or Dilo, maybe you can be kare deliver la bala. It's like before the husband did that for Nadarim. Vasira, Mela, she's going to be a sura. So Tashima, we're going to try to bring a proof. Imagine a, a woman comes and she says she's an Ezira. The husband listens and he says, Vaani, and I. He cannot do that for Nadarim. He said, now if you're going to tell me that he's going to be in the beginning, he should first do the first time in the beginning. He should first do the first time for her and then automatically he's going to be permitted as well. Uh, sorry, the looking at the means that he should leave the day soon. Okay? So therefore, in such a case, what right, is the difference uh, between the Kevayich and the like you? Like uh, Huh? Because because now it's like almost sareni kemotech. It's like I'm. It's like it's, it's kemotech. Exactly. So then that's the question. So when it says sareni ba kevayich be kule minta, it doesn't mean that it's going to be completely permitted because the husband already did hafaran nedarim. Or maybe we're going to say it's like before the hafaran nedarim. So just like before the hafaran nedarim, it's going to be asur. So to now it's going to be asur. So that's what we're asking. That's the doubt. So we're trying to bring a proof to do with when the husband was mekayim the neder. You remember? She comes and she says, Hareni Nezira. Her husband says, Vani. Can he do a Farani Darim? No. No, no, no. So ask the Gimana, why? Let him do a Farani Darim. He could do a Farani Darim to her, but then he would still stay in the Yisur. But rather, the Kulamid, it's the entire thing. It's either all or none. The Hilkach, therefore, Hulo Matzil Mefra, he cannot do a Farani Darim because the Yisha Damra Mit Reich, she's also going to become permitted in such a scenario. Says the Gimana, Lo. No. It's really bad, you're grabbing onto the first words. And here, since he told her, it's like he was mekayem at it. He was mekayem, he validated the, what she just said. And therefore, if she's going to come and ask a chacham to come and to get rid of the kima, then he could actually come and he could do a farat nedarim. But if not, then he cannot do a farat nedarim. Two dots. Hareni Nazir. Imagine a person comes and he says, I'm a Nazir. Ve'at, what about you? Imagine, he comes and he says to his wife, No and you, Ve'amera, Amen. Amen. Yeah? Me'feret shela, ve'shelo kayan. Here, he could do a farat nadarim to her. But his is still going to be kayan. So says the Gemara, well, his is kayan, it's pasuk, because his came first and has nothing to do with her. So he says he's a Nazir. He's a Nazir. What does it have to do with her? Well, the question is, he can still do a farad nidarim to her. Well, meaning you ask the contradiction, Hareni Nazir ve'atvam na'amen, shneem asurim, both of them are going to be asurim. Tim lav, and if she didn't say amen, shnehem mutarim, they're going to be mutarim. Neshetala nidro ben nidira, because he was tole his neder in her neder. Meaning it sounds like that when he said, I'm a Nazir and you, like, you know, what are you? So if she's not going to agree, 
it's much for that he didn't also want to be a Nazir. Meaning he's only a Nazir if she's a Nazira. So Amr of Yehuda says of Yehuda, Tani mafir le, mafir We did learn though that what? That really by man, he could do a Faranda Darim to her, but his is still going to be Kayam. Abaya comes and he says, No. Even if you're going to say, like, just like what we said before, Braita, what is the Braita talking about? The Kamal Ladri said, Hareni Nazir Ve'at. Meaning, it wasn't as if to say like a question. No, and you, no, no, no. Hareni Nazir Ve'at. I'm a Nazir and you. He didn't ask a question. I and you. No. Exactly. He's saying it like as a statement, name. but he's not saying it as a question. The Katali Nidro Benidra. But then he's making his net there, Talui. In her neden, kavgim le mudalaf on the top, umatzniti in our mishnah, he goes to Amalla. For example, he says, "Areni nazid, I'm going to become a nazid." The atmai, what about you? Mishumachim because of that, meferet shela, he can do a farah nederim for her. The shelo kayam, and his is going to be kayam.